Welcome everyone. This is Seattle 206723 with another whiskey review, an elitist whiskey review, where we're going to do a review on Balvini Doublewood. A couple people asked for it in the recent vote. It didn't win, but it still gets a review this time around. So, what do we have? We have a double wood Balvini. The big thing about the double wood Balvini is that there are two casks used in the maturation process, one of oak and the other of a European uh, sherry cask, which I will read for you from the bottle. Many years of maturation exclusively in the traditional whiskey oak cast mellows the maturing spirit and imparts gentle warming layers of vanilla spice. Second cast. Further maturation in European oak sherry cast increases complexity, brings fruity honey depth to resulting single malt. Big thing is it's a 750 ml bottle, which is exclusively pretty much in the U.S. Um, I'm, I, I think maybe Canada gets 750 ml as well, but we definitely do here in the U.S. It's bottled at 43%. <clears throat> I will give you tasting notes, nose. And a finish. Now, to begin this review, we're going to use a Elitis Whiskey Review Coaster. There we have it. It's not folded right. And there we go. So, let's begin. On the nose. A gentle stroll around the glass. Vanilla. Sherry. Some mellow fruits. With a hint of spice. It's 12 years old, so the spice is there. You have to kind of get past it. I can smell the youthfulness within this particular single malt. Okay. On the palate. Sweet, vanilla, sherry, some cocoa at mid palate, and a nice warm vanilla. Again, it's, it's a long finish, it's still finishing, and it's still developing. Getting at the back and mid palate, taste the fruit pears. Yes, it's got a vanilla uh, wood spice finish to it. One more time. Always good to give her a second go around. Oh yeah, that's vanilla. Mm. 
You let it sit there for a moment and develop if you like. And you'll start to get the cocoa, the sherry, the dark fruits, the sweeter notes. But I let it go to the finish this time. And there's a hint of banana within this single malt. Which shows that they did a good job in putting it together. Price point on this particular whiskey double wood was around 60 bucks when I got it. Um, is it worth it? A double wood, I think it was sixty four ninety nine. No, nah, it was sixty bucks. Sixty, yeah, about sixty four with some tax. U.S. dollars seven hundred fifty mL. Bottled at forty three percent. Um, I'd say with the quality that's there, the mellowness, the introduction of two, you know, this is a double wood, a double cask. Um. It's well balanced, well rounded when you're playing off the sherry dark notes with the uh, vanilla spice notes. You get the cocoa, you get the vanilla, you get the spice, you get the uh, note of banana, which is still I'm getting. Um, yeah, it's definitely worth it. I'd say that this is a very rounded whiskey and this, it would be a good introduction whiskey with anyone that you were sitting down with it would be something that you'd pour and the taste the flavor the experience that this whiskey provides would be great and i keep bringing up the 750 ml because i know that there's the the 70 cl we get a little bit more here in the u.s for our dollar the dollar actually goes a little bit further so don't screw it up well thank you for checking out this review I'm going to finish this off, the Seattle Tool 6723, with the Balvini Whiskey Review.